team returned to Worcester early this morning, and although Holy Cross is on spring break, students who are on campus are excited about the news. Today, our Brittany Schaefer got a chance to catch up with some students, the head coach, and the MVP. She joins us now with more. Brittany? Olivia, Holy Cross fans I spoke to today weren't expecting Wednesday night's win, but say they couldn't be more excited for the team. It seems quiet outside the Heart Center Thursday. Most Holy Cross students are on spring break, but inside there's excitement. The Holy Cross men's basketball team is heading to the NCAA tournament. We're most proud because of the hard season that we had. Um, leading up until that point. Holy Cross didn't win a Patriot League road game during the regular season, but four straight in the conference tournament earned the Crusaders their first trip to the NCAAs since 2007. I love the guys, but yeah, I was absolutely surprised. I hadn't won the game on the road and they just, they took it home. They rode the momentum they had, won four straight and they got a championship. They got to go to the tournament. We just had to step it up a level, keep faith in each other and keep faith in our coaches. And um, it turned around for us at the right time. Malachi Alexander scored 26 points last night and was the MVP. We just played well together and hung in there, and it wasn't easy, but uh, the guys came through in you know tough situations. This is Bill Carmody's first year coaching the men's basketball team, and fans are happy with the quick turnaround at the end of the season. He brought the Princeton defense to the Holy Cross team, and I guess it worked out pretty well for them in the playoffs. So. I think he's a good fit. With the new coach obviously coming in, getting a, a title his first season, can't ask for much more. As for the NCAA tournament, fans are excited to watch the team play on, knowing now anything can happen. A bunch of those guys on the team are, are in classes with me, um, so I'll be watching them. Uh, in Providence or Brooklyn or wherever they're playing next. Go for it. Who cares? You're in the tournament now. Make another upset happen. It's awesome. On Sunday, the team and many fans will get together on campus to find out the location of their first game in the NCAA tournament. Olivia, back to you. All right, Brittany.